comments you hear from people regarding professionals possibly competing in the Olympics? A lot of people who talk about it, they're, they're not really very well informed because some of the comments I've heard have been along the lines of, oh, how can you have a professional fighter squaring off in the ring in Rio against an ill-prepared, under-trained, young, callow, naive, innocent little fighter? Now that is just, just so ludicrous, you know, it's, it's barely worth commenting on because all boxers who qualify for the Olympic Games, it's insulting, frankly, because all boxers who qualify for the Olympic Games have done it the hard way, they've taken the hard road, they've either done it here or a competition like this or through WSB or APB or the World Championships or they do it in these final two qualifiers. They're incredibly dedicated and committed um, and there really is no difference between them in many ways and what we term as professional fighters. I've been talking to the GB Lionhearts about this, um, a few of them before their match against the USA a few weeks ago when the news really kind of come out of Manchester at the convention, but it was a real talking point at that time. And the lads I spoke to, like Joe Cordina, European champion, uh, Josh Buatzi, Joe Joyce, World Championship bronze medalist, uh, Mo Ali, another European Championship silver medalist, they all said to me that they're more than happy to fight pros. Over three three-minute rounds, they'll have it with anyone because that's what they're trained for. They would fancy their chances of beating anybody over that distance. And I would strongly fancy their chances of beating anybody over that distance as well. So I think people who make those kinds of comments, really, they need to go and do their homework and then come back and look at it because it just doesn't stack up.